In this video, I will explain how you can merge the branches in VS Code. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a fresh branch and then merge that branch into the master. So currently you can see that I am on the master branch. You can see here at the bottom left side of this VS Code. It is showing the branch that I am on right now. So right now I am on master branch. So let us create a new branch. So I just clicked on the master and then it is showing this menu here. So I am going to create a new branch and the branch name is say B3 and then I am going to press enter and B3 branch is created and you can notice that it is also checked out for us. So right now we are on B3 branch. Let us make some change in this particular branch. I will just remove this VS code here from this file and then save it. And let's add this commit here. So go to the source control, then click on source control, and then here put the source, uh, the message, commit message, completed in B3. Let us just click on the commit. So what we did is that we created a branch B3 from the master branch and then make one change in the file and then committed the change in the branch B3. So notice that the changes that we have done are in the branch B3 and not in the master branch. So if you want to get those changes or the merge those changes from B3 into the master, what you need to do is you need to go to the master branch so i'm going to switch to the master branch so just click on the b3 once again and then click on master so once you click on master you will come back to the master branch you can see that right now you are on the master branch now let us merge the b3 branch into master branch and for that what you have to do is go to the source control and in this source control you will notice that there is a three dots just click on this more actions and then go to branch and then merge branch so here you have to select the branch that you want to merge so we want to merge the branch b3 into the current branch which is master so i'm just going to click on b3 so what will happen is that the changes that are there in the b3 branch branch will come into master branch so basically that will be merged b3 will be merged into master branch so i'm just going to click b3 now the changes have come into the master and once the changes are in the master you can just push those changes by clicking on this button you can also have a look at these commits as well so you can see that the changes that we did in the b3 are available on the master branch